And ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2017 Charlotte Area School District Senior Night. Tonight we are here to honor the commitments of our senior football players, cheerleaders, band members, and golfers, and also their parents. To the seniors, thank you for your strong commitment to our individual program over these past four years. Your hard work and effort and commitment is appreciated by your coaches and your school and your community. To the parents, thank you for your constant support and your dedication for all that you do and have done, and not only for your son and daughter, but also for the program that they have been involved with. With that being said, let's meet our first senior football player. Caleb Carson. <laughs> Caleb is the son of David and Carol Carson. He is a varsity soccer captain and plays varsity basketball for the Cougars. Caleb's most memorable moment in football was deciding to come off for the team his senior year. His future plans are to attend a four-year university, to major in criminal justice, and to eventually become a homicide detective. Caleb would like to get married and have three gorgeous children. He would like to thank mom and pops, his brother and sister, his best buds for keeping him in line, coach Steve Leonard, and most importantly, Jesus. Number seven, Caleb Carson. Our next senior cap, senior football player, Cameron Carter. Cameron is the son of Rosalie Hudoff. He's a member of the football and basketball teams. Cameron's most memorable moment was playing his first high school football game this year. His future plans are to go off to college and play football, but to just be successful in any way he can. Cameron would like to thank the Shawlor football coaching staff and his teammates. Most of all, he would like to thank his mother for never giving up on him and for supporting everything he does and did. He would also like to thank his brother and girlfriend for always being there when he needed them. Number 12, Cameron Carter. Our next senior football player or member, Mr. Trevor Eccles. Trevor resides in Fellowship Township as the, son, as the son of Valerie and Jason Eccles. Trevor is involved with the Cougar Cafe, the Bible Club, and as a student assistant with the football team. Trevor's future plans include traveling around the world and becoming a successful businessman. Trevor would like to thank all of his teachers, the high school staff, and his fellow students for helping him to make many memories. Trevor would also like to thank his parents for all their love and support. Mr. Trevor Eccles. Our next senior football player, George Lukacs. George is the son of George and Nancy Lukacs. He plays basketball and is also a member of the Astronomy Club. George's most memorable moment was throwing a touchdown pass in the first two games of 2017 against Washington High School and South Morton High School. His future plans are to graduate from high school, go to a trade school, move to the beach, open his own garage, get married, and to start a family. George would like to thank God, his dad for coaching him, his mom and his friends. Last but not least, he would like to thank Coach Stevie Leonard. Number three, George Lukacs. <laughs> Our next senior football player, Fernando Muno, Munoz. Fernando is the son of Adriana Rodriguez and Jesus Munoz. He has been a member of the football team for three years. He is also a member of the soccer and baseball teams. Fernando's favorite football memory was being in the backfield with his day one George. His future plans include joining the United States Army and then going to a four-year college to major in criminal justice. Fernando would like to thank his family, friends, and most importantly, God. Number 18, Fernando Munoz. 
Excuse me, number 30. Our next senior football player, Mr. Sammy Rocca. Sammy is the son of Brandy Rocca and Sam and Lisa Rocca. He's also a member of the Astronomy Club and Relay for Life. His favorite football memories are chalking up with the boys before games. Sammy's future plans include working with his dad, getting married, and having kids. He would like to thank his parents, his coaches, and Coach Stevie Leonard for always keeping him motivated. Number 21, Sammy Rocca. Our next senior football player, Dom Santini. Dom is the son of Wayne and Amy Santini. His most memorable moment was when he scored a touchdown his junior year against South Florida High School. Dom's future plans are to get a good job and become very successful. Dom would like to thank his mom, dad, Riley, his grandparents, aunts, uncles, and coach Stevie Leonard. Number 56, Dom Santini. Our next senior football player, Jake Stefanik. Jake is the son of John and Tina Stefanik. Jake is a captain of the football team. He was an honorable mention all-conference linebacker his junior year. Jake is also a member of the drafting club, Relay for Life, and is an honor roll student. His most memorable football moment was traveling to Manesson and beating the Greyhounds his junior year. His future plans are to attend a four-year college or university and earn a degree in mechanical engineering. He plans to get a good job, get married, have a family, and live a happy and healthy life. Jake would like to thank his dad, mom, Emma, grandma, and all of his aunts, uncles, cousins, friends, teammates, teachers, and his coaches for believing and supporting him. Number 44, Jake Stefanik. Our next senior football player, Gabriel Uribe. Gabriel is the son of Gabriel and Sylvia Uribe. Gabriel participates in the ski club, the chess club, is an honor roll student, and is the president of the astronomy club. His favorite football memory is hanging with the boys. Gabe's future plans are to attend a four-year college. Gabriel would like to thank coach Stevie Leonard, his parents, Margaret Deutsch, and his friends. Number four, Gabriel Uribe. <laughs> Our next senior football player, David Wallet. Excuse me, David Wallet. David is the son of Jennifer Morton. David attends Votech for medical. His most memorable football moment was his first interception and football camp. His future plans are to be an emergency medical technician. David would like to thank his family and friends. Number 26, David Wallet.
our final senior football player, Ryan Workman. Ryan is the son of Jennifer and Brad Decaf. He is a four-time Letterman varsity football player and senior team captain. Ryan's most memorable football moment was his junior season coming back at halftime to win the game over Bergenstein. His future plans are to attend college for sports medicine and to continue his football career. Ryan would like to thank his parents, grandparents Tony and Margaret Jesco, and Brad and Darlene Decast, his girlfriend Bailey, coach Stevie Leonard, and his siblings, Billy, Brandon, Connor, Molly, and Megan. Number eight, Ryan Workman. Next, let's meet our cheerleaders. First, Miss Madison Guadalupe. Madison is the daughter of Jennifer and Don, excuse me, Dan Guadalupe, and the granddaughter of Wayne and Joyce Ray, Scooter Guadalupe and Nancy Uhall. Madison is the captain of the varsity cheer squad. Madison is also a member of the Shuller High School show choir and has played lead roles in the past two musicals. She is the yearbook editor and is a team leader for Relay for Life Committee. Madison's favorite cheer memories are winning first place at the Kennywood Cheer Competition, going to nationals at Disney with the old Shawlery Competition Squad, and being able to cheer her senior year with all her friends. Her future plans are to attend a four-year university, majoring in accounting, and to continue to cheer on the sidelines throughout those years. She would also like to get married, have a family, and live happily ever after. Madison would like to thank God, her parents, her brother Ethan, and her Bob and Pap for always supporting her and being there to cheer her on. She would also like to thank her wonderful boyfriend Seth Sapko and his amazing family for always including her. Miss Laura Picnic for always listening to her and giving her advice. Mother Darlene Decast and Buddy for four amazing years of cheering and believing in a sixth grader to compete. And finally, all to all of her former teachers, coaches, friends, and family members for helping her through the journey. Miss Madison Guadalupe. Our next senior cheerleader, Miss Veronica Kovac. Veronica is the daughter of Ron and Beth Ann Kovac. She is captain of the varsity cheerleading team. She is also president of the student council, a member of NHS, class executive committee, the choir, the show choir, the musical, the drama club, SAD, Interact Club, and Teen Outreach. Veronica's most memorable cheer moments were dancing with the band, competing and winning at Kennywood, and every single home game. Her future plans include attending a four-year college or university to major in political science. She would also like to get married, have a nice family, and hopefully become the first female president. Veronica would like to thank her parents, her brother, her family, friends, coaches, guard, God, and her guardian angels. Miss Veronica Kovac. Our last senior cheerleader, Miss Kaylee Such. Kaylee is the daughter of Justin and Kimberly Such. She's a captain of the cheer squad. She is a team captain for Relay for Life Committee, a member of SAD Club, the Astronomy Club, Spanish Club, and History Club. Her most memorable cheer moments were winning the Kennywood era her sophomore year and the football game against Brownsville when all the lights went out. Her future plans include looking forward to her nephew being born and to further her education in the medical field. She would also like to have a family and live life to its fullest. Katie would like to thank her mom, dad, sisters, Alec, and all of her supporters and friends. Miss Kaylee Such. Next, let's meet our senior band members. First, we have Miss Erica Angelo. 
Erica is the daughter of Donna and Victor Angelo. She has been a, a Cougarette for four years. She's a section leader for the Cougarettes. She is also a member of the National Honor Society, the Cougar News Team, the Art Club, the Drama Club, and Relay for Life. Erica participates in musical, musical build crew and is the student technical director of the musical. Her most memorable moment in BAM was her first football game. Erica plans to major in chemical engineering, pursue a career in that field, and adopt as many dogs as she can. She would like to thank Carol Claybaugh for teaching her and making her the twirl she is today. She would also like to thank Miss V and Ben for dealing with her all these years and her family for all their love and support. Erica would also like to thank her friends Amanda and Peyton for always being there. Miss Erica Angelo. Our next senior band member, Miss Haley Edwards. Haley is the daughter of Rebecca Clifford. She is also a member of the Cougarettes. She's an honor roll student, a member of Relay for Life, president of the SCCLA, a nominee for National Academy of Future Physicians and Med Medical Scientists, the Award of Excellence, and a Westinghouse Science Honors Institute. Haley's favorite marching band memory was her first football game. Her future plans were to comp complete pre-med studies at Penn State or Cal U, obtain a master's degree or PhD in medical school, and travel the world with her best friend. Haley would like to thank her best friend, Heidi Lowry, for being there when she needed her most, her mom for always being her number one supporter, and all of her friends for making her senior year absolutely unforgettable. She would also like to thank Mrs. Funkhauser, Mrs. Toth for being her in-school moms, and taking to her all the FC, FCLL events. And she also would like to thank Mrs. Laura Peck Picnic for her being her shoulder to cry on. Miss Haley Edwards. <laughs> Next we have senior member Amanda Hammond. Amanda is the daughter of Jennifer and Gary Hammond. She is also a member of the Marchy Band and Marchy Band Auxiliary. She is an honor roll student and participates in Relay for Life, Art Club, and Musical Pit. Amanda's favorite marching band memory was at her first away game when she forgot to zip her uniform. Her future plans were to attend a Indiana University of Pennsylvania to pursue a degree in nursing and eventually become a nurse anesthetist. She would also like to move to Chicago and get a bunch of dolls. Amanda would like to thank her mom and dad her best friends, Peyton and Erica, for always sticking with her, and the entire marching band of directors for being so wonderful to her. Senior band member, Miss Amanda Hammond. Next, we have senior band member, Miss Emily LeCart. Emily is the daughter of Susan and Michael LeCart. Emily is the Vice President of the Class of 2018, a Student Council School Board, school board Representative, and a Class Representative for SAD. She's a member of the Varsity Soccer and Track Teams, the National Honor Society, Peer Jewelry, Ski Club, and other clubs. She has participated in the IUP Cook Honors College Program and was a member of the 2017 Homecoming Court. Emily is currently the drumline captain. She was selected to be part of the PA Lines All-State Band and the PMEA District Band. Her favorite Friday Night Lights memory was when the lights went out. She will always look back fondly at all of her band memories, bus rides, band camps, band trips, performances, and the bonfires at her house. Emily's future plans are to study business at Penn State or at Virginia Tech. She would also like to be, continue to be a part of the musical ensemble. She would like to thank Mr. Bob Rossi, Mr. Mark Kellinger, Ms. Laura Picnic, and Mr. Ron Spang. Emily would also like to thank her family, God, the members of the U.S. military, and the entire CHS marching band. Miss Emily LeCart. Our next senior band member, Ms. Nick, Mr. Nick Marucci. Nick is the son of Keith and Tracy Marucci. He's been a six-year member of the marching band and has served as drum major for the past two years. 
Nick has been a reach since first grade and has been a member of the academic league for the past five years with, the, with three league championships during that time. He also has participated in Relay for Life, the pit band, and mock trial for the past two years and the hometown high cue. His favorite band memory was going to Disney World with Karen and Carlin and Cole. His future plans are to attend a four-year university to study history for political science. Nick would like to thank his mom and dad, Cole, for being a great friend and a brother all along, and Carlin for always seeing the best in him and being the best friend and girlfriend possible. Mr. Nick Marucci. Our final senior band member, Miss Peyton Worthy. Peyton is the daughter of Heidi and Eric Worthy. She's a three-year member of the Cougarettes. She is also a member of the National Technical Honor Society for two years for exceeding academic achievement at both her home school and trade school. She has been in multimedia design, technology, and commercial art design for three years with consecutive A's each year. Peyton is a member of the art club and, and was president of the Skills USA and competed in leadership competitions. Her most memorable band moment was when Amanda forgot the zipper uniform and performed the zipper down. Payne's future goals are to, are to graduate from IUP with a Bachelor's of Fine Arts degree in Graphic Design, get an amazing student studio job in Graphic Design in the city, get married to the love of her life, buy a nice house with lots of land, and adopt ponies. Peyton would like to thank her amazing mother who keeps her strong. Her dad is always making her laugh. Her brothers for inspiring her. Her sister for keeping her on track. Her best friends Eric and Amanda for growing up with her and helping her through the best and worst of times. And the love of her life, Haley, for anchoring her and letting her know she is safe and loved. Senior member, Peyton Worthy.